uh, to click on Hyperfang. Uh, yep. Yeah, but you know, some some of these mods gotta go. We're gonna get a lot more. We're gonna get a lot more encounters. Don't worry. It's it's a small sacrifice in the short term for the benefit of the run. Hit the hyper fang, buddy. One more, and then we can just quick attack. We beat Watson. Yes. Let's go! Yes! Oh my god, I've never had to... Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm so done seeing your face, man. I remember this guy was like easy to kill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop yapping and start fighting, bro. I forgot. What does he lead with? Ooh, has his own might, Yana. I mean... Can't we just do a Might Yana off? Screw it. Clinch! May the best Might Yana win. I'm faster, so I'm just gonna flinch check him. Come on. Flinch. Yes! <laughs> what a cheese, bro. Oh my god, and a crit? Flinch. Ah, uh, stand attack. Okay, a little cheeky. Super potion. That insecure? That fast? Oh my god, another crit! Oreo's been critting! Flinch. Come on, man. Flinch. PP check, yep. Oh, the sign attack's getting kind of annoying. Flinch. <laughs> You're so bad. You're so bad, bro. Oh, it has two more mods. Okay, too bad. Oh, the last one's a camera up, I remember now. Okay, let's keep biting. Bro, Oreo's like packing heat, no? Like he's just he's just like go he's just staring down at these guys and just biting them. Okay, hold on. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yo 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 I have to switch out I think. Should I go Remy? I could also go Kenny. Let's go Kenny. Why not? Oh my god, a crit! Oh my god, don't confuse, please, don't confuse. Ah oh my god. Okay, you know what? I'm switching that again. Stupid, stupid bat. Okay, Remy, you're in. I think this is quick attack range. Yep. Okay, luckily we brought in Love Disc for this. AKA Lovely. That's fine. Water gun. Uh, that might hurt. Oh yeah, it did. It does hurt a lot. Okay. Good to know, good to know. Wait, this thing is kinda hard. Hold up. Hold up, guys. I actually have to try hard. Do we outspeed this? Probably not. Tackle? You don't want speed this at all. I think we just yawn. Or do we charm? Ah, let's go yawn. Yon is pretty safe. Yon and the charm is even safer. That's fine. Okay. Uh, I don't want to risk turn one wake up though, so I feel like I want to go Remy here. Okay, this is a lot harder fight than I thought. I honestly, I could have lost this fight. I could have lost some some mods in this fight, unintentional. Because I just went and ego with basically. But I didn't. Because I'm better. Look at this. I'm better. Okay, well, I'm still better. I don't care. See? No problem. See, if it doesn't happen, then there was no risk to begin with, right? That's just how it is. Alright, Flannery, you sick son of a gun. You're going down. No more yapping. Just fighting. Here we go, chat. Oh my god, I'm super nervous. But we're in it already. Okay. Alright, Flannery. He leads with Nummel. He'll lead here with Love Disc. So here we do a max damage water gun because the sun isn't up yet. This will take half of it, half of Numo's HP. 
Oh, even more. Okay. That's a really good roll. Then he goes for the Sunny Day. This might prompt Flannery to heal Numo. There you go. Which means less potions for the Torkoal fight later. Okay. So now we take one damage of Overheat. Which is about 40% of our HP. Um, and we kill him with Water Gun. Oh wait! We're faster. Never mind. And we kill him. So we're now full HP love this. Okay. We're looking good. It's looking good. Okay, now Slugma comes out. We can take... We can take one overheat damage here because... Uh, he already has the sun up. There is a chance that he sets up um, light screen here. In which case we don't mind because we're gonna sweep with Machoke anyway. Um... Let's just click on Water Gun, I guess. Okay, that doesn't do a lot. Oh, it goes for Smog. That's fine. That's fine, man. Yo, that's sick. Okay. Wait. He's not even using Overheats. Wait. We're chilling. Okay, does that allow us to kill with... Um, with Takedown? Uh, let's take our Ruler. To see that is about 38 percent 38 percent that should be a kill with takedown and he doesn't he doesn't heal here i don't think she heals here wait wait this is not looking that bad our love disc is still almost full hp hey the love this love disc is like popping off right now okay so this might actually be overheat now. <laughs> we can't really... Now if we're following how the AI has been playing, this could be tackle, but I doubt he tackles a love disc, you know what I mean? It's too precious. So we go into the original plan of going Dunsparce. Oh, he sets up Sunny Day again. We're completely misreading the situation, like... I guess we just yawn? He's not even overheating, look! Wait, this guy's trolling. Wait, maybe this fight's easy after all. Oh, there's the overheat. Okay. He had enough. Alright. Not bad. Okay. Get a little bit of HP. Okay, now... We swap to Machoke, who's pre-burnt. Which is really important because Machoke has guts. This allows Machoke to kill Tamarap with one low kick after... Taking one damage of pursuit. Okay, gotta remember to click on the right move. It's low kick, right? Yep, it is low kick. There you go. We only have Torco left. And we still have the whole team. We haven't sacrificed anyone yet. Yet. Okay, now this is where it gets really tricky. So here, we wanna switch to eradicate. In the event he overheats, then we say 07 to eradicate. 07. Oh, it missed! Wait, it has a chance to miss! Oh my god! Oh my god! I didn't even factor in! Hyper Fang to do some damage. Wait, it doesn't overheat! Oh, we're in the clear! Ah, there you go. Okay. It's too good to be true. Too good to be true. That's fine. 07 for Remy. All part of the plan. Oh yeah, it has white herb. Okay, sure. Um, so now we go into Persian. Chloe, take him down, buddy. Hope for a flinch. Oh, it missed again. Flinch or miss? Flinch or miss? Let's go. Flinch or miss? No. Oh seven. Oh seven, Chloe. You did your job. My king. Okay, now, okay, we didn't check his HP, but it's about like 30-40%. We could make this a little bit more safer by switching into Love Disc and going for Charms. He's not in heal range yet. Oh, he has White Smoke. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I'm actually dumb. I forgot about that ability. Okay, that was kind of scary then. Okay, 
How are we killing this guy? Wait, let's look at the HP with our ruler. Oh, we still have the ruler open. Oh, I didn't even realize. That's about 30% HP. Uh, do we kill with anything here? We kill with low kick. Okay. He's gonna overheat. Does that kill Brianna? I think we just tried to sacrifice Ken uh, Kenny. Or if we get a yawn off, that would be nice. That's fine. Oh, it's it's a win. It's a win. For sure. 07 to Kenny as well. But Brianna's coming out for a low kick. And it's a GG. We beat Flattery! Let's go! And those are planned deaths. Actually, we, we planned like four deaths. We planned like four deaths and like we only got three. So if anything, that's a dub. Let's go, encounter time. Oh, it's a Cacnea. That's kind of useful. That's not that bad. Because I don't want to like lose more HP. Yes, okay. What are we naming Cacnea, guys? Okay, so we cooked up um, a strat against Norman. It's pretty simple. We lead with Might Yena with a Persian Berry to fight against the Spinda and the Tita Dances. This should be pretty easy. Uh, and then depending on whether he sends out Linoon or Vigoroth next, we have either Sableye or Onyx to deal with that. Both uh, either resist or are immune to normal moves. And then by the end, I get his ace. We have Sableye, who hard counters, um, hard counters, uh, slacking entirely. So, without further ado, let's take down our dad. Here we go. I'm not even nervous for this fight. I feel like this fight's pretty chill. Up until I'm proven wrong, I think this fight's an easy fight. Uh, so against Spinda, here we just spam Bite. This this does have a chance to flinch. No tear dances yet. Flinch, please. Yep, there you go. And then we just win. Okay, one down. Three more to go. Sends out Slacking first. Okay. So now we immediately go to Jasper. And then we can go Fake Out. Then we go Faint Attack. Yeah, the yawn really doesn't matter. Because we could be in this fight forever and we'll still win. We'll just tank the sleep turns like a Chad. That's fine. It's gonna be a long fight, but it's gonna be a free fight, pretty much. Because he still has hyper potions. He has yawn and stuff to stall. But I'm pretty sure we just win this fight. If we're lucky, we might even PP stall this guy. Let me drink water while I'm doing this for swag points. Yes, another gym leader. This is the fifth gym leader. Um, but I'm not even taking him seriously. I'm just on my phone. It's that easy. Just on my phone, chilling. Uh, it's too easy, bro. I'm glazing through, yeah. Uh, that might put him in potion range. They might do a hyper potion here. Yep. I'm just gonna reset the fight. Kind of annoying, but we're here. We're we're gonna be here all day. We're not rushing. He has one more Hyper Potion, which he's not reluctant to use. Um, wait, what? Wait, this thing has Faint Attack? Wait, I did not factor that in. Wait. Oh? Wait, did I miss out on something on the preparation? Wait a second. Oh, it does have Faint Attack. It should still be fine. Hold on, I just have to be a little bit more careful now. Ignoring a 2 hours yapping prep, you're about to beat 2 gym leaders in an hour, yeah. Okay. He doesn't always go for the faint attack though, so it's, it's still fine. We're still doing a lot of damage, which is really good. Really crucial against this one. Ah, uh, that's kind of... Sting. That's fine. Okay. I mean, he's really low HP now, and he's not even in potion range. Uh, we got a free switch here. I think we go into... We go into Ellie and we click on Yawn. Put him to sleep. 
We can also uh we can also wish wish past some HP to uh the Sable Eye if we really want to. It's not necessary. Uh here we could just go Brianna, I think. Yeah, we can just go into Brianna. Hello, hello, I'm back with my back. Three hours can I stream me and three hours din ako sa labas? Probably. Okay, he's asleep. Now we're gonna kill him in his sleep. Uh, let me just double check if I have this correct now. Low kick should 100% kill. Okay, his ace is down. His ace is down. The next mon should be super easy now. Even though we, we, we screwed up a little bit of the preparation, we should still win this. Uh, we're worried about slash crit. Slash crit does 57, so we should be fine. Facade does nothing. Okay, we already have one one Pokemon left. It's just Lenun. Jalbi all guys para beat down saya. Yep. Okay. Uh, are we really worried about anything here? I think we just. Send it with a low kick. Yeah, facade does nothing. Okay, a little bit more than nothing. Wait. Burn doesn't proc, right? Because we win? Wait. It doesn't matter. You could die, honestly. And we beat Norman! Let's go! Five badges, baby! Yeah, it doesn't proc. Okay. Easy! That was a deathless Norman, too. Encounter time! Banky, okay. That won't be useful for next fight, but it might be useful at some other fight. Draw a great ball. Nice. Alrighty. Okay, encounter time, guys. What are we gonna get? Seviper. Okay. What's the best Pokemon you can counter? I don't know. I didn't. I didn't uh, research your ball. Kailan season two ng stream? Uh, soon. This one's about to end. Well, well, actually, I don't know. You're right. I don't know when season one, season two starts, but I know season one's about to end. We're making some big pace right now. Like we've we've already up two badges, and we're almost three. We're almost three in just one stream. I'm still taking it slowly though. Don't worry. I don't want to lose all my progress and reset. Go bite. I don't think that works, buddy. Also, how is he faster? With Drew Pelipper. On Buskin. You see his double kick? So against double kick, I guess we go to Jasper. What's my next level cap? Um, It's 33. 33. We're actually almost in a level cap. We can click Nightshade here. Uh, let's fake out first. Yeah, I'm super close. Night shade. Text fine. Nice. Huge. He might go back to his uh Pelipper. Yeah. I expected that. But it's fine, we just click on Nightshade here. Protect is annoying. He just keeps protecting, like what what is she even doing? I think we might end the stream if we can. If I can, I might end the stream like before the Winona fight. Reg irrespective of like what the time is. I mean, like, you know what I mean. Like we might have to end it early if uh, if we're already at Winona. Like I don't wanna if even if we could have, I probably don't wanna do like three badges in one. Just because I feel like I'd be so tired by then and I might make a lot of mistakes. Gorb does nothing. What's your favorite snack to munch on? Um, I'm not sure. Maybe Pringles? I don't know. Pringles, fries, all of those are pretty good. Three more badges, yep. Three more badges in the Elite Four. Hansel? Mm, the only bad part about Hansel for me is that sometimes, like, it's it's so, like, easy to get destroyed. Sometimes it's very good coffee. I could get behind that. Jasper's been really strong this um this run so far. Like he pretty much like 
soloed the entire 5th gym. Almost. Okay, we beat our rival. There you go. I counter time. Kecleon. Wait, this might be good. Wait, Loki, this might be good. I have enough balls left. Uh oh. I might lose this encounter. Never mind. Got him. Please be good. Please be worth it. Please be worth it. I went through so much. Okay, Natu. I mean. Okay, we got a Natu. We got a male Natu. Gave me my encounter. It's a Porygon. That's a great ball. And we got Stantler. Okay. Uh, not Ultra Ball. Okay. Okay, we got a Merc. Okay, thank you. Lunatone. Okay. He won't get into the ball either. Oh, never mind. You can look for an encounter here. We got a Marrow. What? Okay. It's a Quillfish. Nice. Okay. Okay, so. That's it for me, chat. On the next stream, we'll be doing the Winona fight for the sixth badge. Today was a pretty good day. We took down Flannery and Norman for two badges. There's a couple of casualties here and there, but honestly, still pretty good. Good progress, good pacing. What I will do to minimize the time spent on like planning, because um, we did like two hours of planning on the Flannery fight, so what I'll do before I stream the next time is I'll prepare off stream so that when we start the next stream, we just do the fight, right? Hopefully. But I'll explain the strategy I came up with before going to the fight so you guys have a good idea of like what I'll try to execute.